So you know how numbers were created. Wait a minute. Do you? Um, the caveman and stuff? Well, if you don't, then check out our previous video about the history of mathematics and find out the origin of numbers. As for this video, we're going to dig a little deeper on how numerals have developed over the years. A little bonus of history while learning math. I see this as an absolute win. Thirty six hundred BC, the ancient Egyptians came up with a detailed number system. If you recall the last video, the symbols used the image of everyday things to represent numbers. These symbols are called hieroglyphics, which is translated as sacred picture writings. Take a look at these symbols: the staff, the heel, the coil of rope, the lotus flower. The Egyptians use a tally system based on the number 10. 10 of one symbol could be replaced by one of another symbol. We call this a base 10 system. However, the order in which the symbols were written down did not affect the value of numerals. For example, two heels and three staffs. No matter how the orders change, it is still the same value of 23. The ancient Greeks saw the need to include the symbol for 5. This symbol can be combined with the symbols for 10, 100, and 1000 to make 50, 500, and 5000. Isn't that smart? Similar to the Greeks, the Romans used a symbol for 5. The first four numbers are represented by the fingers on one hand, so the symbol V, which is 5, is visualized by the image of the thumb and forefinger of an open hand. Two V's are joined together and become two lots of five, so the 10 is represented by the X. Unlike the Egyptian system, numbers written in Roman system has to be written in order. For example, IV, which represents four, stands for one before five, or VI, six, is one after five. And lastly for today, ever wondered how our modern numerals were found? It was developed in India about 2,000 years ago, and it was introduced to European nations by Arab traders about 1,000 years ago. The system was thus called the Hindu Arabic system. They are made up using the symbols 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0, which are known as digits. However, this is not how it was written at first. The original Hindu Arabic numerals used to look more like this, and they have been changed through time. The Hindu Arabic system is more useful and more efficient than any number system and is still widely used today for the following reasons. It uses only 10 digits to construct all the natural numbers. It uses the digit of 0 to show an empty place value. It has a place value system where digits represent different numbers when placed in different place value columns. It took quite a while for the numbers to take up their form, and surely they are as useful as ever. There is more mathematical knowledge in the upcoming videos of Wesley Academy. Be sure not to miss any of it if you are curious about the existence of mathematics. Spoiler! Wesley Academy is opening an online math and English course for 6th graders after the summer of 2021. So like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel and Facebook page for more information.